The endless leaderboard is broken again. Let me show you why. All right, hey there guys. So check this out. If you go look at the leaderboard, the leaderboard's supposed to work where, you know, the highest wave is obviously on top. And then if there's tied waves, it's supposed to be the lowest time on top. If you look at the first couple guys, it's like 101, 103, you know, 104. It's working correctly. And then you get down like lower and lower here. It actually starts to bug out. So I'm making this video. So that way, you know, you guys aren't getting cheated out on like, you know, high spots. And also the way, that way, like the devs could, you know, if they end up watching my video, they can end up fixing this. So if you go down a little bit here to like the 40s, I've noticed. Look at this, guys. So at 40, it's up to 158 here. I can even zoom in for you guys. So once again, at like, you know, 40, it's at 158, right? But if you go down to 42 here, this dude right here, this guy is getting scammed. Because he finished in one, you know, 124 minutes. Whereas the guy's, you know, a couple spots ahead of him, 158 minutes. So what the heck's that all about, guys? I think that the leaderboard's a little bit bugged. So if you kind of feel like you're getting scammed or, you know, you want someone to, you know, kind of shout this out so the devs find out, don't worry, guys. I got you. Because I noticed this as I was looking at the leaderboard. Something was a little bit off. So hopefully Evan... Or, you know, Talanchik or any or, you know, someone who's a dev on the team, they end up fixing this little bug because, you know, maybe one of you guys are, you know, doing really well, but then you end up like, you know, this guy down here, this, uh, you know, winner. And actually, a lot of, look at this, a lot of people, look at them, all these people, 127 and all that stuff. So, some reason it's bugging out. Like some of these guys, like 150, you know, 158, they're somehow getting ahead of people that are at like 120. So, that makes no sense. Hopefully they fix that. That's why I'm making this video. So if you are getting scammed on the leaderboard, don't worry, guys. I got you back. And also, we're doing a special giveaway for you guys. If you guys didn't know, we're giving away a signed Mech Bunny Titan because you guys helped me complete my sponsor goal during my last sponsorship. So shout out to you guys for that. If you guys would like to enter, just make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, and comment your Roblox username. And once you do those three things, head on over to my website, ltcrazy.com. And once you're on here, guys, Scroll on down till you see the giveaway page. Click that. And by the way, this uh, website will be linked in the description and maybe the pinned comment as well. Also, once you're on the you know Roblox giveaway page, scroll down a little bit more. On the left side, you're going to see the Mech Bunny Titan giveaway. So click use your email, enter your Roblox name, enter your email. It could be fake or real. I don't care. Just make something up if you don't feel comfortable. And then also click the you know agree check mark box. And then you guys will automatically get your automatic entry. And then if you subscribe, follow us on TikTok, like the video, comment, you'll get plus five on all those as well. And also, guys, when you're on my website, go to the Tower Defense Values page. On here, I got all the values for you guys, so you guys do not get scammed. And remember, guys, there is no such thing as an accurate value. They're all suggestions. Every website has their own creator. For me, personally, I made this website up, and they're my suggested values. So, you know, everyone's like that. If you feel like you're getting a good deal, that's what it's all about. If it's a win trade for you, it's a win trade for you. That's how I always see it. And uh, that's how it goes, guys. But anyways, let's get back to Roblox here. What do you guys say we do some sort of fun challenge today and i think that would be really cool because we haven't done a challenge video in a little bit so what type of challenge video could i potentially do here i'm just trying to think guys what kind of challenge video could we do there's so many different things in this game now like so many different items and stuff that like it's just endless right all right i have an idea i have an idea here so let's unequip all let's say i could only use units that are less than 500 actually no is that too that might be too easy less than 250 dollars they have to be less than 250 dollars i can only use units or should we do 300 so that way we can incorporate like the dj tv man let's do 300 just so i could have him because this is gonna be really hard if i'm using like really really bad units so i, I need like a guy to boost me so i gotta use units that are less than 300 dollars so i'll select the dj tv man of course what else though should we select here we definitely need a starter unit and by far the best starter unit in this game is the green laser so he only costs about 150 but you got to be smart enough to find him and clearly lt is not smart enough to find the green laser caravan all right there he is right there what the heck's wrong with you guys i can't find him all right so we got him though that's good now we probably are going to want a speaker repair drone because we're going to be getting stunned a lot the engineer might be op as well let's consider him as a very viable option and what else guys so that speaker repair drone i'm just gonna look him up because like i'm stupid and i can't find him today so there we go i got him and then i'm thinking guys cupid cupid is such a good unit it pierces it does aoe 9000 dps even more if we get that dj tv down this guys should be pretty interesting but now that i'm thinking about it if i use this squad i don't necessarily have 
like oh boys i got a problem here i don't have a santa tv man i gotta take out the green laser okay because the green laser i don't need him i'll use the cupid instead and she's better for like long game so we'll use that and we'll go santa tv that's only 200 dollars. so boom perfect now we gotta decide what map to play on hmm lots of choices here lots of choices we could go to palm paradise that might be fun it'll be actually be really good because the track Ooh, let's go Palm Paradise. Let's try this map out. Because also, it's pretty new. So, that'll be pretty fun to kind of check out and whatnot. So, let's go try it out. And let's see if we can pull this off. And by the way, guys, this video is sponsored by Call of Dragons. If you guys have not played that game yet. And you're playing on a PC or laptop or something like that. You guys have to check out this game, Call of Dragons. All right, boys? I'm serious. It's amazing. I'll show you guys some gameplay in a little bit. Once we're a little bit more settled with our troops. But man, is it good. I got a link in the description. If you guys use that link, it does directly support my channel. So appreciate you guys a lot. There's a couple of goals for you to complete. If you get your like city hall to level five, you get your thing to level 11. Or if you get the Lilia pack or the efficiency or trailblazer pack, that directly supports me, guys. So thank you guys. But just remember, you have to be on PC and you had to, you know, make sure that you use my link. If you did that, you guys are supporting your boys. So I appreciate y'all a lot for that. But of course, we're going to do auto skip only, guys, because like, Auto skip only is the move. We gotta do auto skip only. Otherwise, that's just that's just weak. We're better than that. We're we're too good for this to not do auto skip only. And by the way, guys, so you know how we're doing the Mech Bunny Time giveaway for uh, hitting that one goal in the last sponsorship. Of course, if we hit some goals during this sponsorship, we will uh, you know obviously do some more big giveaways for you guys because when we hit these cool goals, it really helps the channel out. So I appreciate you guys a lot when we do that. So thank you. But. Uh, like I said, later on, I'll show you exactly what to do in the game. But for right now, we got to focus up and make sure we get the job done here until it's out of fence. We can't, we can't, uh, you know, do, you know, too many things at once. Otherwise, we're going to get a little bit distracted. And we don't want to get distracted because then I'll probably end up losing. And if I end up losing, well, I'm going to be a little bit disappointed in myself because I feel like I could win this, you know, relatively easily. Maybe not super easily. And I, I probably should get these, like, Santas, like, a little bit closer to the track here. Like, I'll probably get the next Santa, guys, like, right here. Just because I think that's going to be a little bit uh, better for us. Maybe not. Maybe so. I don't know. We're going to find out together. Here we go. Let's get him down. Sweet. There we go. And then the next uh, auto skip, I should be able to upgrade one of these camera women. And that is going to make that Cupid really, really strong. Because it basically goes from being, like, 400, right? To being 1,200. So, that's a big upgrade from, like, just a couple hundred dollars, right? Like, that. that's, you know, that's a big deal. That really is. Because... At first, she's pretty weak, but then, but then she goes OP mode. All right, though, let's uh, let's get these guys upgraded here, the Santas, because why not, right? We might as well. And there's some other units we could get down here, like the engineer and stuff. The engineer is going to be very, very good, and I feel like I'm going to need to get him upgraded. But before I do that, let's upgrade this Cupid here because there's bosses coming after us now. Bosses? We don't mess around with no bosses, guys. Seriously, like they could uh, end up easily killing us. So let's get down a DJ here. That'll be very, very good. And then the next upgrade is $2,000 on these cupids here. So that's kind of expensive, and there's no way I'm affording that. But if we could kill this mutant toy here, I don't know why we ain't shooting it. Come on, uh, cupid. Let's go. Wake up. What are we doing? Hey, they weren't shooting it there for a second, guys. Did y'all see that? Like, what the heck was that all about? But if I could get her upgraded again here, I'm telling you right now, we're going to be in a very, very good situation because the damage goes from 1,200, and then you add on another 1,800. So it's like doubling the damage, almost tripling it. So really, really effective. But we about... Oh, no, no, no. We almost got stunned. We did get stunned. Our, our DJ got stunned there. That was bad. That could be really bad if, uh, you know, you let it keep going on. But luckily... It got unstunned relatively quickly there. So we got to just hopefully take out some of these units a little bit quicker here. If we could do that, I think we'll be okay. Let's just get down an engineer there. And that was actually perfect timing because if you guys noticed, we actually like didn't end up getting stunned there. So that was like actually beautiful. All right, though, we got $1,500. Not quite enough yet. I, you know, I just want to keep on upgrading these guys because, you know, if we do that, then we'll be fine. We could upgrade the engineer a little bit too. We'll have 5,000 HP. It looks like we're getting a little bit overwhelmed here. That's obviously not good. I could get down some more cupids as well because, once again, cupids are fairly effective. So it's definitely a good idea to get them down. And I could actually upgrade this one now. So that way she's super strong, doing tons of damage. So if you guys could tell, there we go. Boom. She's making plays happen left and right out here. Now, I do have a lot of enemies coming after us. So that, that could be a problem, but I don't think it's going to be, at least not for, for very long, because I do have a lot of engineers on the track now, so they should be able to handle these enemies somewhat easily. Now, there's still one more upgrade on these cupids too, which is the crazy part, right? Like, it seems like she's really good already, but like, no, 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 she gets stronger. I know, right? It seems crazy. 
But yeah, she does get stronger, which is awesome. Let's get down some more engineers here, just to kind of like stun bait them, you know, the enemies and stuff. And that way we don't have to really worry about them. So I think that's going to be a pretty smart move for us. So we'll do that. We'll also upgrade some more Santas just so, you know, get that money up a little bit more. And where are my engineers at, guys? Do they just disappear off the map? What the heck is going on? Where are my engineers at? No one's, no one's uh, pulling up. Maybe those, like, all the assassins were the ones kind of, like, messing with them and killing them. So that could be the reason. I'm not too sure, but they ain't spawning in yet. Like, what the heck is going on? I mean, I see them over there, but they're, like, they don't get to this side of the track. I don't know what's happening, guys. What the heck is going on here? Anyways, let's get this Cupid upgraded here very shortly. All right, guys, it's wave 15. I just upgraded a few of my Santas. Like I said I was going to do, we'll upgrade that one too. And then we got this airplane still coming after us right now. That thing is actually kind of speedy. That might be a problem. But uh, it shouldn't be if I upgrade this guy here a couple times. That way, I got a lot of, uh, you know, DPS later on down the track, down the line. We could uh, take that airplane out, hopefully, with my toilets if, uh, you know, it's going to be big enough here. I don't know if it's going to be or not. I might have to wait on that $800 and get that engineer upgraded. Otherwise, boys, I might be in big trouble. I seriously might be in big trouble here. Come on, we gotta get that 500, 400, 300, 200, 100 dollars. Come on, quick. There we go. Okay, engineer is upgraded. So that airplane, if it doesn't die to, okay, yeah, it's not getting hit by most of those toilets there. So I don't know. It might get hit by that one though. Let's see. I'm not sure. Yeah, I did. Okay, never mind. We're, we're chilling, guys. We're chilling. We don't actually have to really, really worry about like anything. So that's good, I suppose, right? And then soon enough here, we could actually get this next upgrade. Boom. There we go. Now we can start doing some big damage with the cupids. So that's exactly what we wanted to do. We, uh, you know, we were trying to do that the whole time, obviously, but like it was getting a little hectic, so we couldn't, but uh, now we could. So here we go. Let's get the job done. Now we got that one engineer be able to take out some mutant and a boss. I think it'll be able to do that relatively easily. So let's not worry. Let's get the next Cupid upgraded. Boom, there we go. They keep stunning this poor Santa over here. I can't do anything. He keeps getting stunned. What the heck, guys? He legit just keeps getting stunned nonstop. Like I can't upgrade him because he's stunned. 20, 4, 7. Poor man. But uh, hey, look at these cupids now. They're doing a lot more DPS, so that's good. Is it enough? Uh, maybe. I'm not sure yet. It's uh, it's all going to depend on you know a couple more upgrades here, and we'll see if we could actually pull this off or not. I probably shouldn't get this one upgraded back here, in all honesty, but I already did, so it's a little too late now. And then soon enough here, I should probably put a little bit of money actually into my DJ TV. I don't know why I haven't upgraded him yet, because he keeps getting stunned probably. That's probably why. He's kind of like... Not useless, but, like, he just keeps getting stunned. So, like, what the heck's he on about right now? I don't know. I don't know, guys. He needs to wake up, get the job done here, stay, like, alert. Because he keeps falling asleep. I mean, that's kind of messed up. He shouldn't be doing that, right? But, uh, here we go. How about those bosses? Are they dead? The bosses are dead. Looks like we got some engineers on the track. The tanks. That's good. Get this guy upgraded over here. That way he could do 9,000 DPS as well. So, now we're absolutely tearing these enemies up here. So, this is a really, really good sign. You know fairly good sign i would say we uh we should be chilling for quite some time here we could actually get this santa upgraded and i know it's wave 22 already and like we're not doing too good with their santa upgrades but like i kind of had to like do it this way because if i didn't well we'd probably be dead i needed to waste a lot of money here <laughs> otherwise we might have been in a little bit of trouble but now i suppose it's a good time to maybe get some engineers upgraded some more of them those are really effective only in solo mode guys i always say that the engineers suck because they do but if you're playing in solo mode, they are fairly, fairly good. By the way, guys, if you want an engineer, come to my streams. We've been doing a bunch of cool little, like, I got this cool little wheel, and I spin it, and if it lands on the engineer, you'll win it. So if that sounds like something you want to take a part of, you know, join my stream. It's going to be a really fun time. But anyways, let's get this one upgraded. We'll upgrade the DJ here twice, and I'm broke. So <laughs> let's, uh, I guess, wait for some more money here, because I am broke. Very, very, very broke. Now... I could just, you know, let's see here. I was going to say I could sell some guys, but nah, I want to keep what I got. It's fine. I, I mean, should I upgrade these Santas at this point? Like, does it matter? Do I need them upgraded? It would be nice. It's still, yeah, well, mm, I don't know. But it's 26. I don't think I really need them upgraded in all honesty. I think that would be a waste. Let's just, uh, let's just do the engineer. Yeah, let's just do that. There we go. Max out in our engineer. Sweet. Ah, maybe I can max out this one too, or at least be really close. Just $900 off. That's not bad. I mean, we'll get it maxed out here pretty shortly. Look at this. We got a tank in the front lines too. Sweet, guys. I mean, that's a good setup if you ask me. The UFO is kind of getting far, but shouldn't be too much of a big deal. And then this engineer here. I think we got all of our engineers maxed. Level 6. Yep, all of our engineers are maxed out now, guys. Sweet. And even this guy back here somehow shoots. I don't know how. Don't ask me. But he's got good range. 
He's got really good range. Or she's got really good range. Sweet. All right, let's get that one upgraded too. We'll get down some more. I suppose I could get like one here if that... No, 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 no. We're not going to do that because the, the, the boost doesn't like actually affect it. So we'll just put it back here. It, it'll be fine. It's not ideal like positioning, but like... Who cares at this point, right? And plus, we're going to end up selling these Santas. So it was actually a smart move for me not upgrading them. Because that would have just been a waste. So I would have, you know, I had 1800 extra dollars there. And I'm going to because I didn't spend it. So sweet. We made the right move. Let's go. All right. So wave 30. Let's get this guy double upgraded. Girl double upgraded. You know, whatever. And do I have anything else that I need to delete? Not really. I think we're looking good. And we got all tanks on the map now. That's crazy. Look at that. So if that's 200,000 DPS every like 20 seconds that's quite a bit if, you know back in the day that used to be so much nowadays you're probably like 200 dps that's nothing which you're kind of right because the hyper does over that in about half a second but uh it's still fairly good for this type of challenge you know low budget so it's working out right i mean wave 31 so far we didn't win yet by any means but we ain't doing bad let me tell you that we ain't doing bad at all let me just sell all these guys i feel like i don't need them no more and hey we'll get down some more cupids just opens up our ability here to be even stronger so that's the plan here let's get some cupids right there get another cupid right there not ideal positioning like i said before but like at this point it's gonna be okay don't uh don't freak out at me i know I, you're supposed to get them in a nice line like right here would have been good right here would be good too but then my dj without a leprechaun they don't really fit very well so you kind of well this one right here maybe i could actually move this one to like right there that might be a little bit better right maybe yeah that, that's probably a little bit of a better spot so we'll do that but everything else is kind of just like you know get them wherever i can place them down and as long as i get them down that's gonna be good this guy back here though i should probably move them up a little bit maybe to the front too just because they're so far away that they don't really shoot quick enough so now though as soon as these enemies spawn they're like automatically shooting, which is exactly what you want to be doing. The only problem here, though, I could see it, you know, potentially making us lose is if we have like a explosive guy come after us, like when they spawn in and they like kind of like suicide into you. That would be really bad. That would be really, really, really bad. So hopefully we could dodge that. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to or not, but look at this security guy coming after us. That could have been bad, but the tank right there just melted it straight up melted it so pretty good pretty darn good i will uh take that any day of the week absolutely now we're on wave 37 here that welder toilet just absolutely did that like toxic toilet dirty right there he just picked them up and then just held them in place stood still and then he just died well look at that the tanks are splitting up right now where's he going i wish they stopped i wish they didn't just die when they walked into the wall but i guess that might be too op but like like I said again, guys, the engineer should be better for how rare he really and truly is. Personally, I think that. I just think, though, back in the day, guys, when this game was brand new, I actually summoned an engineer. Did y'all know that? I actually have a video on this channel where I actually summoned an engineer. I know that sounds crazy, right? It is. But I did. At one point, way back in the day, it might be on your screen now. You should go check that video out. It was like man probably like six months ago but i bought my you know robux i got it and that was like even before trading i think so it was a super super cool moment and i just couldn't believe i did it so i wonder who has my og like straight up original you won't even know that's the crazy part like i wish there was something like summoned by lt crazy or something like that i wish that was like a tag you could have in the game well that's a new unit i don't remember ever seeing that but guys we're kind of getting overwhelmed right now what the heck is going on i think we're getting stunned i think that's why here that, that you know when we get stunned like that so i'm saying that's a problem it could go really really poorly for you but look at all these tanks they're so op the way they're stacked up like that right now yo that's so good for us a lot not good though is all these enemies coming after us here that's really bad but i mean look at us go we're still alive we're still cooking out here and wave 41 getting a little sketchy though i ain't gonna lie it's getting a little bit sketch however even these bosses and stuff they're gonna go down and like all those dual toilets and stuff they're like two arrows and they're dead so that's not a big deal but it's these big guys that are the problem the beret guy here like he could be a problem and i mean it's definitely yo okay so see that's where this is gonna go wrong yep those explosive guys i knew it that's what killed us guys if that you know if we do lose here it's because of those explosive guys darn it you want to know what i should have done i should have put like i don't know if it's gonna be too late or not i'm gonna sell her i'm gonna put her right here 
and that is just bait straight bait all right same thing with this one right here if i'm able to i'm gonna sell it but it might be too late guys it's straight up might be too late i, I actually, actually maybe move this one over here and we'll go like that on the track we could sell some more move another one over here and this may not be completely ideal but i think it'll we'll get the job done for us because these guys on the track are going to come all the way down here and then we're going to run into me over there and we'll get them i think i hope <laughs> we'll see we shall see we shall see but uh i could potentially also if i'm able to here i need to sell my dj tv and move him over because he keeps getting stunned like instantly and i can't even i can't pick him up i can't delete him that's annoying but don't place your dj tv where i place mine guys because it's it's not working out very well for me all right let me tell you no i deleted the wrong guy darn it well let's get this guy here and that'll be decent there we go i can tell yes i got it guys i got it i got it we're chilling all right let's max him out now sweet there we go and this isn't a game over yet it's it's not looking good but check this out i'm gonna go like this i can even sell another one and we can sell them and move them over here this might be just enough to fix what we've you know the mistakes we've made in this match we might be able to save ourselves if i could just sell that unit there yep all right cool we'll get that one right there and you know these cupids they're they're keeping us in this right now for sure they really are but i'm not sure i'm gonna sell that one back over there too because that one's just not necessary i'm just gonna put it here and the engineers should do the, the stun bait for us now that should be you know just fine for us i think maybe not but i'm pretty sure oh wait no that guy wasn't uh close enough so we'll have to put like this one like right there hopefully the like explosive toilet dudes don't come for us but they still might i'm not sure oh oh no 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 oh they, they like blocked it somehow the heck i've never seen that before they actually blocked it all right well if that's the case i'm still gonna keep one back here just just for safety measures all right guys just for safety measures and i just realized i just realized this guys i literally have a repair drone i totally forgot i brought that in what am i thinking here what was i thinking guys i got a repair drone let's wake him up get him actually working here because i totally forgot i had him i'm an idiot i usually see guys the thing is i normally don't bring speaker repair drones on my team i don't know if you all ever watch my videos and realize that but like yeah yeah no like, i never bring them in so like i just totally forgot i had him forgot to make use of him but look how effective he is because he's like literally making those guys stop in their tracks that's what he's doing so that's that's awesome but i wish we were shooting some of these guys right now we're just not really doing anything we're letting all these dudes kind of like pile up on us back here at the uh back half of the track and it could be bad if that boss gets you know over here it could be really bad so we got to be super super careful otherwise oh boys we're gonna die but from what i see right now things are looking pretty good and i mean look at this we're even doing some damage to the boss right now every time the arrow shoots about two percent or something so decent look at four percent every time the arrow shoots sweet all right cool whoa the giant spool toilet got destroyed right there one quarter of his health gone already but they got the glitch toilet oh the glitch toilet just got stopped by all the uh, engineers so that was really good so good to see whoa look at this stack up over here though we stacked boys we are stacked that's good that's gonna be really effective i mean yeah they're just wiping these guys out left and right so that's a good sign but to get the cupids cupids are holding it down could you guys believe that you could win basically I, I mean i think i win this game here but you could win with just like units under 500 dollars like that nightmare mode's a joke now this game's so easy now guys back in the day which i'm not saying that's a bad thing but like back in the day this game used to be so hard and you have to use so much strategy but like nowadays i mean i guess i probably would have lost if i didn't do this strategy where i moved all my guys over but i'm pretty sure a gen a brain can figure that one out ain't that right guys so yes you could do it i believe in y'all but uh yeah we got soldier rockets so it's coming this way i mean they might kill us but i don't think so we should stay alive here i'm pretty sure unless we get stunned if we get stunned at some point then that'll be really bad but i mean regardless i think we end up winning how many tanks are right there i can't tell if that's one or like 10 you never know right like i don't know but there's definitely like 10 over here in the back side i mean look at that that's a lot that's a good sign but all these uh you know people they gotta really put in some work here guys i mean this this might be bad I, I still got that repair drone down too though so if we do get stunned at any point it's a gg for the enemies but i mean i think we got it i mean what what's really gonna kill us here i don't really expect anything to get by at this point i mean they got a million of hp but like still that doesn't even mean anything and plus like 
Where's the... Oh, here's the boss right here. He's, like, catching up. He's running past all the other enemies. He's supposed to be last in line. But look at him. He's up next. Here we go. Can we take out... Oh, he's about to, he's about to meet his army. He's about to meet his death. Let's see here. Wow. Like, that was 500,000 DPS. I mean, it's not... Didn't kill him, but, like, it's good. It's definitely good. Come on. We're so close. So close, guys. Let's go. Wake up. Wake up. That oven. No, the oven's bad. Oven's really bad. Okay, we got it. All right, we won. We win, we win, we win. 100%. Because that science totally moves so much slower than the uh, Michael Jackson looking guy. So we chilling, boys. We chilling out here. Might even take that out before it hits all the tanks. No, don't hit the tanks. Sweet. All right. Scientist toilet here. Last boss to deal with. The OG Santa guy. What the heck is that? I don't even know. Interesting avatar. Interesting model, guys. All right. One unit left. One unit left. Quad Rocky Mutant Toilet. Can we take him out? I sure hope so. <laughs> but we'll see. Come on. Get him, boys. Girls. Everyone. Get him. He's about to meet the tank army, though. Holy smokes. That's a lot of tanks right there. At least five. And yeah, that did not feel good. GG, guys. We won. In only 20 minutes, too. Not bad. That was not bad at all. Let's go back to the lobby. Two things you got to do. Number one, open up the mailbox. Because I got to shout out your uh, names for the gifts. Thank you guys for all your gifts. Number two... We're going to go to the trading plaza. And number three, we actually got to check out the sponsor game. So let's go do that. And I'll meet you guys at the mailbox. All right, guys, we're at the mailbox now. So remember, the mailbox, guys, is gifts only. Do not send items in here to sign. If you did send me something to sign, I do keep everything, okay? Just because I do warn you guys in all my videos, in the comments, and literally even to land trick warns you guys, do not expect people to sign or receive something back if you send something through the mailbox, okay? So please do not do that, all right? If you want something signed, I sign in my streams all day, every day. So please, feel free to join me. But, let's go ahead and claim some awesome gifts from some awesome people. So, I love dinosaurs. Thank you, buddy. We got Hoser. We got Willow, Sus, Zake, Zake, Sonic, Poppy, NBP, I am, CJ, J, Corey, 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 Corey. Oh my goodness, Corey. Thank you, bro. CJ, 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 CJ. Again, again, David, Cold, you're cooled. We got Blue, Sonic, Curb, Hot Dog, Leandro, Leandro, Isaac, Jelly, Animalishia. Not too sure. <laughs> Barbecue. I like Sonic, 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 Zombie, Totally George, Totally George, The Mushroom King, Smokey, Armin, CJ, CJ, CJ. All these crates, man. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. So many crates, guys. I'm going to be able to, you know, hopefully get those to maybe some of you guys anyone here need a bunny crate let me know because right, the event is over now we got bat here xxx friend daki i like speedy bruno 1520 mech melvin sonic 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 poke sonic sonic again sonic again oh my goodness man thank you bro fct dinosaur fct hoser and LNK and Arvin. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate all the free gifts. Thank you guys. Sweet. That's awesome. That's really cool. You guys are super generous. I appreciate it. All right. Before we get to the trading puzzle, let's check out Call of Dragons, guys, because I want to show you guys exactly what this game is all about. So, Call of Dragons, this right here, it's really cool. You basically build up a big village, attack a bunch of enemies, and we're trying to take over the map within our alliance. If you guys want to join, it's called the uh, LT Army right here. So, just join that. But to join, you got to make sure if you go to your top left profile picture, click that. You got to make sure you're in server 361, guys. So if you're applying and you're not in that server, click settings, click accounts and characters, and then create a new one in this server, okay? So click it, and then 361 is Thunderbolt more. So make sure you join that. And remember, guys, to download the game, just use the link in the uh, like description of this video, or it might be in the Discord or somewhere in there. But definitely, it's going to be in the description. So check that out. Make sure you use the link if you're a PC player. You can download the game, support my channel, and you know help your boy out. I really do appreciate that a lot. There's a bunch of different things you can do in here, too. Research makes you stronger and stuff like that. Just the pretty obvious thing. So we're going to research. And then also, guys, the goals. So you see this thing right here, the Hall of Order? You got to get this to level 5. That's the first goal. And when you do complete these goals, get proof. Because if you bring it over to my sponsor uh, proof section of the Discord and you show me that you did it and it actually counts for the goals in the bottom right down there you guys can see it on the screen now you're gonna get to spin the engineer wheel at a for a chance at a signed engineer so like one spin for getting your thing to level five if you get your hall of order to level 11 five spins if you end up getting yourself 
the Lilith, it's, I think it's called Lilia Hero, this girl right here. She is uh, basically like a starter pack in the game. If you click like the market area, she'll be in here for $1. And then also that's going to be in here. It's called the efficiency pack. That allows you to build two things at once. So you can see here, I'm upgrading my hall of order and I'm also doing my, actually, no, I'm not doing anything right now. I could upgrade something else. So we'll upgrade that. There we go. We got two things upgrading at once. Super effective to like rank up quick. And then obviously the last thing you get is called the trailblazer pack. And that's really awesome too. So that pack, like, that pack pops up when you buy something in the game. So as soon as you do that, it'll pop right up on your screen. And if you get that, that's like five or six like spins in the wheel. Same thing with uh, the other one, the efficiency pack. And then the Lilia pack is one spin. So thank you guys. If you do check those out, it's, you know, super supportive to the channel. And once again, thank you to Call of Dragons for sponsoring yet another one of my videos. Thank you guys so much. Let's get back to Roblox. And guys, I think we're going to go into the trading plaza and just see if there's any like good deals i like i always like to check it out maybe there's like i don't know who knows maybe there's like a utc in here for like super cheap or a uh, utdm i don't know you never know right i mean who knows the server seems pretty packed though i'm not gonna lie but nope i like never been in a server where i've seen someone selling a utdm however even if there was one i don't know if i'd buy it because i just feel kind of sus that it would be like duped or something so i don't know if i would actually like buy it it's tough to say definitely a little tough to say but in all honesty, in here, doesn't really look like there's many good units. No, not at all. Why is that guy selling that for 700? What the heck? That's ridiculous. <laughs> no way. No, thank you. How was that? 2.3k? Nah, we, you know, we don't, we don't really want none of this stuff, guys. These bunny crates though are still going for pretty cheap. 43, I'll buy that right now. Scoop that up. Heck yeah. You could flip that in the future for way more even all these like 70 ones probably could sell them for like 100 each so that's uh definitely something to keep in mind i would probably scoop that up and buy it but i'm gonna pass for right now just because i'm getting tired we're filming this video at 4 24 a.m right now i think i'm gonna go to sleep <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm getting really exhausted and by the way if you guys want to play arc on ps4 or ps5 for those of you that are playing i got the base down so it's gonna be super fun i might play a little bit and Try to get some dinos for us so that's gonna be pretty cool but uh guys if you made it this far in the video you're absolute legends stay awesome all right don't forget if you did make it this far and you haven't liked yet or subscribed yet do those things comment for the youtube algorithm it all helps out a bunch check out call of dragons if you're a pc player and most importantly if you want to watch another video of mine check out the one on your screen right now click it and i'll see you guys over there adios